Israel Adesanya is set to make his title defense again in the middleweight division and we'll see if his next challenger has what it takes to defeat him. If we've seen anything at all with this fight against Jan, you'll need to be able to both stand with him without taking too much damage and be able to take him down to win. However, before all that action, let's take a look at the style bender's incredible lifestyle and his net worth. In this video, we'll see how Adesanya got into fighting, his fame and fortune, lavish New Zealand lifestyle, and hidden girlfriend. Remember to like, subscribe, and chat with us about this famed fighter in the comment section below. Number 1. Getting into the fight gate Did you know that prior to becoming the middleweight champion, Israel spent a lot of time training and honing his skill set in the kickboxing world? Not only that, but he has had one heck of a career at 75 wins and only 5 losses. One of his most spectacular feats in kickboxing, he defeated 9 men in 3 nights to win the 24-man King in the Ring tournament. If we go back further, we get to understand what shapes this fighter's life and his passion inside the octagon. Israel never set out to be a fighter like many UFC fame champions. Instead, he found the sport in his late teens and actually chose the path of an elite fighter after taking an interest in Muay Thai. Prior to that, he worked at a tannery and even had publicly said that it was the hardest job he's ever had. In an interview, he stated, I just don't want to be one of those guys working at Tasman Tannery or the factory for 60 years just to get a gold watch. It didn't take my 16 years. As we'll see later in this video, the Stylebender got much more than just a gold watch after his rise in the MMA world. Once Adesanya made his way into UFC in 2018, his ascension to the throne came shortly after. He amassed the record of 7-0 and beat the top fighters in the division to claim UFC gold. Along the way, he fought elite fighters such as Derek Brunson, Marvin Vittori, and Robert Whittaker. Nothing short of spectacular, he has also made incredible defenses against Yoel Romero and Paulo Costa. These names in themselves show off the level of striking that Israel has, and more importantly, his ability to stay on his feet and escape situations that would take him to the ground. MMA fans aren't so sure there's anyone that can compete with Israel when it comes to his striking ability. Many believe that he's one of the best, if not the best, striker in the league. Who do you think can hold their own against Adesanya? Number 2. Net Worth, Fame and Fortune After ascending to the UFC middleweight throne, Adesanya captured the love of many for his incredible fights with Kelvin Gastelum and knockout of Robert Whittaker, another New Zealand star. Not only a famous fighter and representing both New Zealand and Nigeria, he's also gained worldwide fame after his war with Calvin Gaslam. This became the fight of the year in 2019 and still regarded as one of the best fights in the UFC. Israel is also the face of UFC 4 and has signed a multi-year deal with Puma, making him the first fighter to have such a contract. This is the same company that holds contracts with other top athletes such as Neymar and Usain Bolt. It is estimated that with all these promotional partnerships, along with his purses and pay-per-view cuts, he's made over $10 million. In his most recent fight with Jan Blahovic, Israel took home over $600,000, and he got a sponsorship bonus of $40,000 even though he lost the fight. With all this, the famed fighter chooses to spend that money on incredible cars, homes, his family, and more, as we'll see in the next section. Number 3. Lavish New Zealand Lifestyle For some people, they celebrate their wins by buying designer clothes, accessories, or food, but not Israel Adesanya. After his fight against Robert Whittaker at UFC 243 for the middleweight belt, the Stylebender purchased a 2019 Orange McLaren 720S Spider. This references back to his passion and love of anime, as he named the car Kuruma, and says in his Instagram post, the chakra this beast possess is way too much for most to handle. Yeah. Anime. Anime. Fuck yeah, I'm about that life. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> I'm about that life. Nerd shit. This is Kurama. The okay. Nine-Tailed Fox, the demon fox from Naruto. And you see the eyes of Kurama? You see yeah. the eyes of my car? Very similar. See the color? Same thing. And it took me four years to watch 720 episodes. Oh, wow. So that's the 720. You can say that again. This McLaren sports a 4.0 liter V8 engine and can go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 2.9 seconds. Car enthusiasts consider this to be the near perfect sports car and is estimated to be valued between $450,000 and $600,000. He doesn't keep his love of cars for himself as he also splurges on his family saying that he doesn't wait for his loved ones to pass on, 
before giving them flowers. Prior to UFC 259, he gifted his mom a red Porsche, and then after the loss, he upgraded his father's car to a Bentley Continental GT 2021. Together, these two cars can cost at a baseline of $350,000. This goes to show that Israel is thinking of those who have stuck with him throughout the low points of his life. They now get to ride with him during his rise. In addition, it's said that he's lived a private life when it comes to his home and personal relationship. Aside from family, we don't really get to see much of his dating life and close friends. However, it's quite hard to escape from the spotlight. One thing MMA fans have found out is that there's this mysterious woman he's seen taking pictures with and having a bath. Could this be his future wife? Number 4. Love of Animes So what did Adesanya do while he was in high school before getting into fighting? Well, one thing he was interested in and still am is Japanese anime. He is obsessed with Death Note and the Naruto series and even received ink on his body representing characters in those anime. You also get to see clips of him acting out characters in these different animes both at press conferences and even when taunting opponents in the ring. There's something to be said of Naruto and how the main characters has a similar story of being bullied as a young kid to become a famous ninja in his world. In a similar case, the style bender mentioned being subjected to racism after moving to New Zealand for schooling, especially during his high school years. Adesanya also attributed the mistreatment he experienced as part of his decision to pursue martial arts. Both anime and his hard past has made an impact in this fighter's life, and ultimately made him who he is today. He's not only the number 3 ranked pound for pound fighter, but also holds UFC gold in the middleweight division. He has also defended his belt twice, with the next several challengers being fighters he has already beaten before. A dominant force in the UFC, Israel Adesanya looks to go beyond that. He has a dream of what every young nerdy kid could be, and uses his fame and influence to help others around the world. What part of Israel Adesanya's life do you like the most? Is it his love of anime, or is it his past and how he's made it into the UFC? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for checking out this video on the Stylebender, and we'll see you next time on Knockout TV.